In this Business Tech Planet video, we'll show you how to fix the connection error in OneNote. If your network connection is working, but you still get the connection error, it's possible that your antivirus or firewall is blocking the application. Start by temporarily disabling your antivirus or firewall to check if that's the problem. The method will depend on the software you're using, but in Avast, you can go to Core Shields, and then disable the files in Web Shield. If OneNote works after disabling the security software, you can fix the problem by creating an exception for OneNote. To do that, click the cog icon in the top right. Then click Add Exceptions. Now locate and select OneNote in the Applications folder. And finally, hit Open. Once complete, you'll see the exception listed below. But if your security software isn't causing the problem, you can try clearing your OneNote cache. To do that in Windows, start by right-clicking OneNote in the taskbar, and selecting Close Window. Once you've closed OneNote, open File Explorer. Then click the address bar at the top and type percent. Local app data. Percent. Backslash Microsoft. Backslash OneNote. Backslash 16.0. Backslash cache. Now hit enter. Here, press Ctrl and A on your keyboard to select all items. Then right click any of the selected items and hit the bin icon to delete them. Once they're deleted, reopen OneNote and try to sync your notebooks again. To clear the OneNote cache on a Mac, start by right-clicking the application in the dock. Then select Quit. Once you've closed OneNote, head up to Go at the top. Then select Go to folder in the drop-down. Next, clear the address bar at the top, and then head to the video description, where you can copy the path to the cache folder. Now head back and paste the path into the address bar. Click the path below, and the OneNote cache folder will open. Here, press Command and A on your keyboard to select all items. Then right-click any of the selected items, and hit Move to Trash. Once that's done, restart OneNote, and try to sync your notebooks. If one of your notebooks is showing the connection error, while the others are connected, that may indicate a corrupted notebook. You can solve the problem by copying sections to a new notebook, and checking for the error after you copy each section. On Windows, go to File. Then New. Now select a location to save in. And then enter a name for the notebook, and hit Create. Once you've done that, right-click one of the sections in your notebook, then select Move or Copy. In the dialog box, select the notebook you want to copy to. Then head down and hit Copy. You should now find the copied section under the new notebook in the left menu. To do that on a Mac, head to File at the top, then select New Notebook. Once created, right-click one of the sections in your disconnected notebook. Then select Copy Section 2 in the pop-up menu. In the dialog box, select the new notebook, then head down and click Copy. Now click the current notebook at the top of the left menu, and select the new one. And you should now see the copied section. If copying a section causes the new notebook to disconnect, you'll have identified the problematic section, which you can delete, or copy and paste the page contents to a new section or notebook. You can also try restoring an old version. On a Mac, go to File at the top, and open Backups. Now select your notebook. Then head down, and click Open. In Windows, go to File. Then head across and click Open Backups. Double-click the corrupted notebook, then select an older version, and hit Open. That's all for this video. If you found it helpful, why not buy us a coffee? We'd really appreciate it, and you'll be helping us grow the channel. Thanks for watching. Remember to check the description for additional resources. And don't forget to subscribe for more Microsoft videos.